Trouble. Hey, Greg. Here's the big one. Man. Well, there goes half the field. Sure does. And it's Ryan Newman leading them around. Oh, Jimmy Johnson. Jimmy Johnson. Hopes in his final Daytona 500. Kurt Busch, another former Daytona 500 winner. Brad Keselowski trying to win it for the first time. All torn up. Bubba Wallace, Eric Almarola, one of the fastest forwards in this entire field. And here's Martin Truex, who couldn't get back to the lead pack and gets all torn up. Smoke out yeah, the that's exhaust not pipe. not a tire problem for no. the 18 of Kyle Busch. We are, of course, under caution with 15 to go. Watch the outside line here, Jeff. You can see Joey Logano really aggressive to the rear bumper of the 10. He's going to push him all the way up to the 2. And they just, right before the 10 gets there, there's a little bit of movement. And that little bit of movement, when you make that much contact, turns your car right around. That's exactly what happened to Brad Keselowski and the 10 of uh, Amarola. And that happens right in front of most of the field. And that really all started with a big push from Joey Logano. Remember Joey Logano talking on the radio earlier about you got to tell me when I'm pushing that car and it's going to make contact with the car in front of us. Well, that happened right there with his teammate. Here's our Ford onboard camera with Logano. You could hear he started to lift, but unfortunately Amarola's car started sort of swaying back and forth right before he made contact with the two. Hooks his bumper, turns him around. Oh, he slammed Alex Bowman. And then it's on. And for the second time in less than a handful of years, Eric Almarola ends up being knocked out of a good chance to win the Daytona 500. Here they, on board with Austin Dillon. He even downshifted trying to get that car slowed down enough to avoid this accident. Riding with Jimmy Johnson, our Chevy cam. Ooh, just gets slammed when the cars loses control. I think that was Mark Truex Jr. Came down, made heavy contact with Jimmy on the right side. Here's another look at this. Yeah, watch these three cars right here. You've got Joey Logano, who's locked onto the rear bumper of Eric Almarola. There's going to be a big shove here. And you see the back of the car already moving right as he gets to the rear bumper of the two of Brad Keselowski. All it takes is the slightest amount of sideways motion to get that two car of Keselowski turning sideways. Really, I mean, Eric Almarola is basically the meat between the sandwich there. He's, he's getting pushed from Joey Logano. He's going up to the rear bumper. He has no choice but to bump draft the two. All Brad can do is try to hold the steering wheel straight. I mean, this is just a, aggressive racing in the end of this race. Ross Chastain was having such a great day. Bummer to see him get caught up in that. 